So it's kind of a last minute thing whether you get in there or not. Uh, I have been told Eric Holder's probably a good chance we're going to get to him. And of course our congressional delegation will be, be back in Raleigh probably, or Raleigh, be back in Washington probably Tuesday. So we'll get to them. If we got a hospital that can make it and we've got a conservative business plan that shows it can be successful and they close our hospital out of greed and immorality, I got to do something. So here I am, sore. Well, the managers of the LLC misled the membership. One of the things they did is they told the members that if the town took back the hospital and the hospital failed, that the LLC members would be personally liable. That was totally false. An LLC, by its very nature and by statute, is designed to limit the liability exposure for members of that LLC. Is that the norm for an LLC to uh, have that? LLC stands for Limited Liability Company, and uh, you generally will form a LLC as a way of providing limitation on liability in certain business endeavors. The other representation that was made is that for the $3 million it would take for the business plan to be successful, that the LLC members had to come up with $28,000 a person in order to take the hospital back. So there were two bits of information that were outright false that made people uh, you think about their vote and think, well, I, I don't want to be responsible for the hospital personally if something happens, and I don't have $28,000 to put in the hospital. Those two things were false, and they caused a vote that was not representative of the true mindset in that room. What risk would the managers of the LLC have if they presided over a meeting with false information to, to manipulate an outcome? I don't know if uh, uh, violated any specific laws, but there's a general assumption that in, um, when you have fiduciary duty, it's a corporation. So the managers of it have fiduciary duties to all the members to be honest, to be uh, candid, forthcoming mm -hmm. when you're uh, making decisions, particularly money decisions. The more important question, in my view, is and it's the duty of all of us, is to get the facts out to people as uh, best we can right now and to ensure that of those 103 people or however many that are members of this LLC, that they know that they were uh, uh, not given full and complete and maybe disinformation at that meeting and probably at other meetings, and that they know what... Uh, financial interests maybe some of the people that are in the leadership of that group have in uh, things going a certain way. You know, the whole idea of, of uh, having to disclose any spatial interest you may have, particularly financial interest in any right. decision before that group. Those are the areas that if I were the FBI, which is the investigative arm of the U.S. Attorney, that I would be interested in going around and asking people about.